and this is Emre and I'll give you a quick demo of our new desktop application. As you can see the application sits right here in the system bar and it has logo of the group that it belongs to. So in this case our example is Stanford 99 so the group logo, I mean the application logo is Stanford logo. Okay, so the advantages uh, of this application is two false. So the first one is, you know, recently Neing has uh, decided to discontinue their free service. And the reason why they do that is because they're not able to monetize their free networks as much as, you know, they spend on bandwidth. This tool uses a very innovative peer-to-peer -peer technology which allows us to reduce our costs. And as a result of that, we're able to give you a great service for free without charging you. So that's the very first advantage and that's a very big differentiator. Um, apart from that, this, is, this has been something our users have been asking for for a very long time. Um, our users want to expand their experience into other platforms. They don't want to be stuck into the web interface only. They want to be, they want their community to be reachable from uh, from their phone or from their social network, and that's why we did we created this, for example, uh, Facebook uh, app maker, which lets them create their own Facebook application for their community site in just a few clicks. And we also have this iPhone interface, and an iPhone app maker is also in our roadmap. But anyways. People are spending so much time on their desktop, so it makes sense to have a desktop application as well. And this desktop application currently has limited functionality because this application is currently in alpha mode. And what it does basically is this chat functionality, which also you can reach from the web interface. But in the upcoming versions, we will have a um, notification system. So whenever someone um, uh, in your group uh, or your friends um, makes a uh, uploads the content or comments on your blog entry or something like that or a new member joins in uh, you'll be notified either by a voice or by a, a, a flash alert so it's up to you okay enough talking now let's get back to an example uh, I'll start with videos because as you know videos spend a lot of they consume a lot of uh, a lot of uh, bandwidth. Oh, this was a YouTube video, so I'll, I'll give you a demo from, from a native uh, groups video. Okay, so here we go. Um, okay, so this video is normally uh, supposed to uh, serve you from group servers, but in this example, it will serve you from your friends because it's using this peer-to-peer uh, -peer technology that I just mentioned and so if the content is already available in one of your friends, if they already watched it, it's going to be served from them, or it will be, if, if you are the first one, it, you will fetch it from our service first and you will start sharing it with your, with your friends. So basically the technology here is, is libtorrent. It's BitTorrent, yeah. So this, is, uh, this screen is to backtrace what's going on behind the scenes. I will click the start button and we'll, start, we'll see what's going on. Um, so, for the sake of this alpha uh, version, uh, downloading and serving are not simultaneous, but this is something, of course, uh, which is in our to-do list before the public release. Okay, I click the start button right now and see what's going on behind the scenes. Okay, so the BitTorrent client started downloading the files. It's actually firstly fetching the, 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 uh, the peers and now it's starting downloading and once it finishes, um, uh, it, it will start serving the content. You see. Okay, yeah, that's enough. So this was a sequential, but as we said, uh, the, 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 the parallel version is also coming. Um, hope you liked it. This is a very important feature because this is reducing the cost significantly and it makes it possible for us to give this great service uh, in an unlimited way uh, for free. So this is very important for consumers and I think this is a very innovative approach to tackle this problem. Hope you liked it and thanks for watching. Bye.